the knife. Hey, come on, you know what you gotta do. I folded the video. Oh, yes! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> All right. Damn. Yes. He's got to be trolling. I don't. No, he's not. I played with Kane before. I do not think that Kane is first off trolling. The, the solution is to sometimes fold a set of gloves. I'm, well, that's what I'm saying. After our argument, Matt, Matt, we're like, like the, you like argued against doing everything a little bit at the time. You're like, then you're gonna take this stance here. <laughs> Remember that time when you're, we had that really stupid argument about three betting, where you were like, should you three bet like three betting bad hands a small amount of the time? Do you remember the same? Or flatting three bets, sorry. Flatting three bets a small amount of the time. It was I'm, like, I'm saying that there are circumstances against certain players in which I would fold my button. Okay. They suited All right. When they cut off open. All right, that's, that's fair. If pre ante in the tournament, Alan Kessler opens a cutoff <laughs> and I have ace eight suited on the button, I may contemplate a fold. I think rake matters a lot too, though. And stack depth. Those are both really important. In this game, no rake and deep. It's a lot tougher. You know? Maybe. That is true. But you have reverse and flight odds if someone makes a straight flush and you make the ace high flush. Right. That's true. Wow, game. I might start coming to these. <laughs> Thank you, Frank. Also, Finally. Also, Doug, there were three there were three antis, which should make me more likely to fold. I have more players behind me left to act. It's not just a small blind and a big one. Forty five or fifty five. I don't know. <laughs> The thing is for me, like the kinds of hands that, that I might fold, like the difference, the, the cutoff, is just like way, way lower than that. So like I would, I would fold a couple more, but like not, not many. I mean, I don't think I would ever fold two days to the button to an open. To an under the gun open? To an open. To a, sorry, to a cutoff open. To a cutoff open. And, and also I just want to say to like a reasonable sized open, obviously it's only right. like whatever. And, yeah. Or if there was like there were, if there was like insane shenanigans going on behind me, then I might, <laughs> I might like consider. But this is not that lineup. <laughs> yeah, there's no curious. Yeah, there's there's there. almost no scenario where I'm pulling two today on the button to cut all open. So there's no PLO player alive that could do that. Yeah. Pulling well, with what? Like so the you ace eight of clubs on the button if the cutoff opens, then there's just. I say almost no scenario. I don't think I've ever done it. So I, I mean, if if it was, you know, nine or ten handed, and everyone limped, and nine, then you know it's just raised, and you don't know what everyone else. I is don't know do, how much I fold ace eight offsuit on the button to a cutoff open. Much more that's, often that's than ace eight. Mistake. That's a big mistake. Now let's talk about the six and four game. Can't be a big mistake. Yes, it can. I mean, it's like a three big wide pre flop play. Can't ever be. A Solution hit. is to like fold. Ace do soft suit some percentage of the time in an unopened pot on your button. I run so bad, man. It's so fucking dirty. <sighs> <laughs> that one, one. I, I, I'm less. I feel a little stronger about. That's also a little bit of just like, I think I think that with the post fall. Nice hand, Frank. I think we'll, we'll get there. From my from my. Can I see that one? Soft suit to the hand yeah. flop well. Well, you're gonna play some. That was very dirty. How I lost that one. Huh? That was very dirty. Oh, well, I didn't mean it. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you yeah. fold? Jack's full. Jack's full. Damn, I really. That's why I bet so big. There. I thought you had something like that. You don't think, think Frank's got fold. any moves, huh? Damn. Huh? He that he pulled Jack's full. Didn't even really think about it that long. He, he tanked with a pair of fives against him for a while. Unfortunately, <laughs> and Sean I was and I right both times. Way too the way tank. Too many oh, hands come on, right? Well, I, we're gonna take away that you were right in the hand you folded to the ASI bluff. <laughs> I mean, I considered for a long time for calling, but you, you didn't. That's fold a really warped view of earlier, right. So you were right there. Was <laughs> I was right both times. It's like no. <laughs> By that logic, it's hard to be wrong. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing, man. Yeah, I mean, if he just tanks every hand, he's right every hand. Unless he's wrong, which unless well, no, but if he's he's, but if he tanks, he's not really wrong because he tanked and was right. Very good point. So. Tanking, I'm considering that I'm good. Right. I just fold quickly. I know I'm not good. Right, but if you tank, then That's, you're just right was, every hand. That was pretty pretty amazing. This is advanced poker. Yeah. It's the next level stuff, obviously. Yeah, I don't play enough. No, this is <laughs> the company to run. <laughs> He would need the tank and fold, right? Right. He would no, need no, the no. tank and fold. He could, he could still tank and call and then say, oh, I was going to say I knew folding. 
I knew that he had it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah sure. As long as, as, long as he tanked. I was right. <laughs> right. As long as he tanked. Right. Before the game. Before the game. I did not say 88. I just said I've played 10 games in the last few years, and they're like all in that. It's so good. Sometimes it just comes down to tonic. The uh, first day I started the Taekwondo training uh, with Master Chang, who probably weighed, I don't know, 150 pounds when I weighed 310. Um, he was on all fours, and I just reached over and sort of flipped him you know, up, and he looks up to me and goes, oh, Avi, oh, you so strong. <laughs> and like, pucker. Like, I knew, I knew that was a tell that something bad was going to happen. And in about three seconds, I was on the ground and like, Tapping, I, he just like had me on the ground. I could not get him off, and you know, wow, yeah. But if he laid flat on the ground, what? and then you just laid on top of him, no, not a chance. He probably would have had a hard time getting you off. No, not a chance. Yeah. No, 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 not a chance. I would have been flipped up. If he was laying on his stuff, absolutely prone, arms absolutely. stretched out in front of him, you were just laying flat across. At only two X, yeah. Right. At only two X, he could get out. If you put yeah. an 800-pound person on top of someone, then probably. Well, if you were 310, he was 150. Yeah. He absolutely could have. That's pretty strong. You should restrain his arms better. If you ever have that opportunity again. It's, yeah, the, well, all four. Well, I'll be seeing like him in September and thanking right. him, so. Forget what he retires, but. Does Frank have training again? I did wrestling, yeah, for oh. two years. Whew. I was in. A lot more wrestling here than so I would have think, anticipated. So you think yeah. someone double the weight just lying on top Fifth of a wrestler, huh? that wrestler would be pinned. Somebody what? Someone double the weight of a wrestler. Someone just getting on top of that wrestler versus someone who's never trained wrestler. No, if you're strong enough, if you got enough upper body strength, then they don't they yeah. don't keep your arms trapped so that you can actually push up. Yeah. Then yeah. Anything's well, that's the thing. Possible. If you don't start in a in like a you know a hold. Yeah. Right. But if you don't start in a hold and you don't know how to get into a, get out of being gotten into a hold, yeah. I think you have no shot. Yeah, but if you've got somebody down and you've got their arms under control, it's, it's really hard. Yeah, but hard just being on top of them doesn't. But getting their arms under control is a technique as well. It is, but a lot of that has to do with where their arms are. That's true. And yeah. I mean, actually, a lot more. I mean, hips is. Equally important, I think. Dude, it's been 40, not 40 years, yeah. but close. Hips don't lie. Huh? Hips don't lie. You can't All do the twist, you can't. Uh... Oh, he's on. I do not have a set. Oh, God. Does he have a set? Oh? Oh, God. <laughs> That's exactly what you're saying. Do you not have a set of? have like queen ten suited here every time. So frustrating. He's got queens. I wish. I wish I had one queen. But he's got two. If which one do you want to see? It's not a queen. Well, I mean, if you. Oh, you can see one. Oh, you're still. I'm. I'm not folding. Okay. Right. Well, okay. Oh, so he's got aces. <laughs> <laughs> Deduction. All right, well, how many times do you want to go? Twice. Twice it is. What do you have? I have Jack 10 suited. It's not a very good card. It's also not a very good card. Yeah, the flush draws have not been coming today. No, they Four really haven't. God, he made a pair again. Huh? Brutal. How about that? That's okay. Thank you, guys. Brilliant. Your aces are so Do not try <laughs> to draw a flush against this man today. 26. You guys are doing it wrong. You guys are trying too early. Now it's <laughs> uh, two. Two tens is brutal, too. Hey, you like free stuff? 
I'm betting you said yes. Hey, it's Chris Hansen. We have a brand new free app, a poker app, the Poker Night in America downloadable app. You can find it in your app store. The links are in the descriptions below. We're always giving free stuff away on the app. You can play against people from all over the world. So what are you waiting for? My mother would appreciate it if you would download our new app today. It was like, it was, I thought it was like 96. 98. 98, yeah. yeah. Uh, then I was a pro by then. Yeah. You were a pro by 98? No way. No, I wasn't. Never mind. No way. Yeah, then no I, the first time I saw it, I was no a pro shot. then. That's what happened. That might be. Well, yeah. And if you saw yeah, it like yeah. when you were young. Because at some like, point, someone's like, like you know, says something about rounders, and you're like, oh, I haven't seen that. You haven't seen it. And then you're going to have to see yeah, rounders, right. you know? But you say, they say the same thing about Game of Thrones, and you don't do that. So what's the difference? There's hey, a difference. Hey, Z man. He's mine. You do a better Grace? Chewbacca. I do. <laughs> You're right. You do a better Chewbacca. <laughs> I don't do a good job not fish Russian. I'm not going to go as far as to say it wasn't good. It was perfectly adequate, right. but your Chewbacca is, is legendary. Yeah. yeah. Your Chewbacca, they could recast that role. I yeah. just haven't won a $20,000 They could stuff you into tonight. a monkey suit and put a no, I'd look belt like an around e your ass. I'd look like an e wookie you know. It just wouldn't be good. Yeah. Like an Ewok wookie how do we How do we get you to lose that bet? Or we get you into a, the a Wookiee suit whoever, with an Whoever belt. loses the wrestling bet has to dress oh, up as okay. Chewbacca for a day. I got you. That's funny. That's a good I, idea. I would still like to see this this wrestling match go down. Especially if they do the sumo thing. Yeah, yes! <laughs> <I think. laughs> Sean was all about the wrestling match and then kind of backpedaled right out of it. I usually do that when someone says, I've been training the keto and I will wear my gi that I already <laughs> own. That's... Usually a good reason to back down. You don't want to wrestle. I mean, with he was a little bit too forthcoming with the fun. information too quickly. Like, yeah. You should have booked the bet and then been like, <laughs> get yourself out in the deep yeah. water. Yeah. <laughs> and then try to flail around. Full disclosure, you know, this is it. You can buy out now for 99%. And I'll be like, here you go. We're just set the odds. But yeah, but we're talking about dressing said, up like I'm a Wookiee. Willing to do Oh. It's not even money. Yeah, you can't right. buy out of that bet. You just end up playing a W. Play so poker as a Wookiee. Yeah, like a Wookiee or something. Play poker as a Wookiee. Man, they are ro I'm like jealous that we're not at the slot tournament, right? That's the slot tournament? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Tell me they're not having a better time than us. Definitely a better time than Doug after paying a tip pot. <laughs> no, Doug did that with a smile on his face. Let him be. He did it quickly. I'll give him credit. You know? He laughed along with everybody else. Yes. <laughs> Chili? Cold here today. Freezing. I'm gonna steal it. So, how much do you have on? Thank you. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Come on, show Queen Jack of Hearts. What happened? 
Show the knife. Hey, come on. You know what you gotta do. I folded the Oh, yes. What the fuck? All right. Damn. That's strong. That's strong. Hey, thanks for watching. Be sure to click subscribe if you want to see more from Poker Night in America. And oh, click that little like button as well. Come on. You won't.